It's really, oh, I, I have no power in writing oh, anymore. Left is weak. Not weak. You already grip like a professional. You yeah. see, you it's already right. take a grip like a professional. Oh, you know how to do it. Let's go. Let's go. Oh, come on. Tells me it will be so much. Oh, oh my gosh. Too strong. You are strong. Give me five. That's the same yeah, thing me. that's it. <laughs> <laughs> so, never racing wombat and. Like we saw, me and Dad and Jason saw him on the TV. Then they, first they slipped, and then yeah, and then like Devin was trying hard. Yes, yeah. One ball was just about to beat him, but Devin like pulled him up a little bit. Yeah. And, yes. And then they like then the ref said so when they slipped, they yeah. The, Devin like, turned around and then. Yeah, it's correct. It's correct. So Devon loved to pull in a strap match. He loved to be like as much connected with his opponent as possible. He loved the eye contact. He loved the mind games. He like, you know, understand everything. He feel everything. And he wants to go inside the mind of his opponent. And uh, when he grabbed the wrist of his opponent, they grabbed the hand. And uh, when we speak, for example, for him, hand control is everything. And he wants to keep his opponent to closer. So when they slipped, it was according his plan. He wants to his opponent to, to be strapped with him in by one strap to be closer. And uh, do you remember the first match when they pulled with Levan? Like first match was like, yeah. they just go in the center. And everyone, everyone think that it will be flash pin or that, something. That one like achieved himself for the match. Yeah, yeah. So nobody was able to stop Levan, yeah? Nobody was able, not a lot of people in the Levin history. Used to be weak. <laughs> he was not weak, he was strong because. He said he used to be weak. Ah, okay, okay. Like, uh, he was uh, in the first round, it was absolutely equal in the center position. And uh, after, after I remember even during an interview, Levan says that he feels that if he will be trying to go like in the typical for him way to try to go to use wrist and go by top row he was said and i feel that i can lose my wrist that's why i was start to go by uh flash flop press because it was comfortable position for flop press and he think he will be keep safe his wrist and uh trying to go there and actually he's 180 kilos yeah he's a huge guy Devon was keeping him there a couple of the seconds so it was also he was keeping him there in that position when Levan was by all the body push his hand and I believe that in this first round Devon uh, spent too much energy gives too much to that and in the second uh, Levan was without any like hardness on his wrist because he was keeping safe at him by the first round and he was very very accents on the attack and I know by myself that if you go with Devon if you go fastly and you little bit open in the end so it's a little bit easier. Like. So I believe that Levan takes the best strategy with uh, Devon. Yeah. But it was for sure not easy. It was for, even it was looks like this, it was for sure not easy. No, you're really good. Yeah, you, you take it like, you know, you know what you do and you're also strong. <laughs> but if you go harder, then you'll fail like that. Oh, oh like let's you know. go. <laughs> okay, 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 let's go. Oh, come on. <laughs> <laughs> Give me some chance. You're really powerful. What is your body weight? Sixty pounds. So it's like thirty kilos, yeah. Sixty kilos. You know, <laughs> honestly, you are the strongest thirty kilos young man I have ever met. <laughs> because See? you know, honestly, it's always you know we just make a jokes. But you really pull. You really pull hard. It does. It does. It's, it's cool. Yeah. His grandma. He lose. <laughs> he he trying started. harder, harder. Yeah. yeah, he was. You know, he was the guy who was. If it's not works from the first time, he was push harder. Like it's actually the champion's character. When you want, like when you know to give up, but you want to more, more, and more, and you give everything about yourself. And uh, that's why I believe he become this kind of champion. And now he's like a library of our mess, like you know everything. And, you know, it's honored to pull with him because he always he's open-minded and he share everything he knows with everyone who he's practicing. So he's a fantastic guy. 
very special. Match. When I saw Levon and Devin the first match, yeah, I I thought that like I thought that he would get smoked the next time they first. Uh -huh. The first round, I thought it was gonna be yeah. a good match, but then it was just like. So what I, what I can tell you by really you know, like what I feel that he become after the first loss much more better. He's really much more better. And some some guys think that he have some wrist, but he don't have center, he don't have shoulder power. Now he's really good, really good. And like if we would take the guy who is like in kilos 120, and we take the pure power of arm wrestling of, of his size, so I really believe he's the best in the world for sure in his weight category. Levan is also a fantastic guy. He like he built himself by the years, take uh, like all the knowledges of previous arm wrestlers, and uh, he's uh, you know he's a Hulk. He's huge. Yeah, he's 180 kilos. And uh, that collision of the time terms was very special because it motivates all the world. We also was watching like like a kids for that match. The world was so excited, and it motivates every one of us to become better, to become better, better, and better. You know, nothing changed. I remember like when I watched my first match. Uh, I was older than you. I was like already somewhere near to the teenage. But I was remember how how excited I was to watch it. That these big guys was pulling with you know 100 percent of the power, was screaming with you know. With everything which a uh, professional wrestling match showed to the people, it was fantastic. I remember it until now. Like John Brzenk matches, Richard cool. Lapkiss and Devon, and uh, also Crazy George. Like you know, Crazy George, he's like 70s years old now, and the, the guy who's the king of his base category. Not so many people can beat him, and he's 70 years old. It's fantastic. That's true. He yeah. hangs. Yeah, yeah, yeah. The king's move. King's yeah, move. he he like he was built himself and find something which somebody said it's minuses and he converted in the pluses of his body in how to use it and it's really great when you open your talent and improve it and improve it and improve it and improve it. It's fantastic. But who would have won the game when it was um um like when Wombat was um Wombat? Received Devin. I believe Devon. Yeah. Yeah, like yeah. Ronbat is very good. Devon is too special guy. So yeah. He Devin. knows when to slip out. Oh. He fouls. Yeah, yeah. He's funny too. Yeah, for sure. For sure. He's <laughs> one of the funniest guys. <laughs> You'll be fine. You are really good. Yeah. <laughs>